Some years ago, we spent two glorious weeks holiday with friends on the Isle of Skye. One evening, we had eaten late in Flodigarry on the northeast of the island. When we emerged from the restaurant, it was dark outside. It was a beautiful clear night, and I stood in complete awe and wonder, gazing at a panorama of thousands of twinkling stars lighting up the sky as far as the eye could see. When I had expressed my appreciation and amazement time and again, to the point of being boring, our friends who come from Wolverhampton in the crowded West Midlands said, but Alison, you have skies just like that at home. And of course we had, living in the countryside as we did, with no street lights. I had, however, never stood on my own doorstep with that same sense of wonder and awe at the night sky. How often, when in darkness, do we fail to see the light? This Advent time, let us go forward in faith, remembering that Jesus said, I am the light of the world and that he also commissioned us to be like him and light up other people's lives by our actions. The psalmist says in Psalm 119, your word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path.